Terry Hood. Our top story here at 6 o'clock, a handwritten letter may provide new clues about the murder of a Tulsa mother. Someone shot and killed Demisha Hunter last month in her own home. Now homicide detectives are looking for the woman who wrote that letter, hoping she can provide some answers about what happened. News on 6 reporter Tara Breland has the new developments. On September 16th, a month before she was killed, Demisha Hunter received a letter from a woman. It reads, Demisha, just to let you know, I'm four months pregnant, and it's your husband's. Demisha's husband is Leroy Hunter Jr. He is currently in jail on domestic violence charges. The letter says the woman carried on a relationship with Leroy for two years. She writes that she doesn't care that Leroy is married and is not getting an abortion. It's signed, Kiki. Until we figure out who Kiki is, and, and I talk to her, and uh, you know, I don't know if she's involved at all, or she just may have information about what happened. Um, that's why we have to find her and talk to her. Demisha was working on a troubled relationship, but her family says just three months into her marriage, she filed a protective order against Leroy. She tried to make it work, you know, although she did know that it was not a good situation for her to be in, you know. She really struggled with that because she really, you know, loved the person. On October 14th, Leroy told police he was at work talking to Demisha on the phone. She told him someone was at the door. When she didn't return to the phone, Leroy says he went home and found her shot to death. We didn't find any indications that this was a home invasion robbery. Uh, Demisha wasn't involved in, in, in things that you know, a lot of times we see lead up to somebody being murdered. Police say they don't know why Demisha was shot and killed, which is why they hope the woman who penned the letter will come forward. She obviously knows Leroy, Demisha. She knows their relationship. Uh, she may know things that are were going on in Demisha's life or Leroy's life at the time that could have, you know, could have been related to what happened to Demisha. Detectives say the letter's return address was to the Apache Manor Apartments. Anyone with information about Kiki, who would be about five to seven months pregnant right now, was asked to call Crime Stoppers. That number, 596-COPS. Tara Vreeland, News on